Hey guys, so today I'm doing a packaged video and um, how to package your hay, food, um, pallets, etc, etc. Um, but first, I wanted to show you the little dude. We just got done playing, oh, we just got done playing a little game. I had a thing up there and he had veggies on it. It was like, it wasn't a veggie bowl, but it was just a cute little game that we played, huh? <laughs> We're going to move it back. All right, let's move it backwards. So yeah, let's get started. So first I just wanted to show you what I keep my hay in and my vegetables when I put them in the cage and his pellets, but his vegetable bowl was out of the cage. So up on the loft, we just have all that. We will do a cage tour later. But we just keep his hay in this um, homemade hay rack that I used. I found out that the old hay rack that he was using, he didn't ever eat out of it. So he eats out of this one all the time. So I just made it out of extra fleece and I didn't sew it. I just clipped it with these binder clips. And then I keep his pellets in this bowl. Then I'll show you what I keep his um, veggies in that bowl. And to keep his veggies in this bowl because, yeah. All right, packaged items. So first we're gonna start off with his pellets. So I have had him for a month and four days. And if you guys remember um, when I did like this one video, um, I had like all of his stuff ready and everything. And this thing was full of pellets. Now, this is how much pellets he went through. And he have ate all of them, maybe a couple because I threw them away probably but he ate all of them pretty much and but maybe like four or five um and whoa and i've had them for a month and a half and i still have probably maybe a full another one of these um that i can fill up because i have more but yeah so we just have this i really like this um it's really nice um I mean, I wouldn't really recommend it for, like, I mean, I don't know. It does really easily come open, but what I do like about it is that his pellets are fresh. So his pellets are fresh. I mean, they smell fresh. They smell like they just came out of where they used to be. They're really nice. Um, if you guys didn't know, I just give him... Um, what is it called? Walmart pellets. Um, I really like the brand that he's on and I read all the ingredients and stuff. But yeah, I mean, I really do like this container for his pellets. I like the fact that it came with a little scooper, which he gets one and a half every day. And then in the morning, it's usually gone, so I just give him a little bit more. I like a half a scoop. But I really do like this container for pellets. I got it at the Dollar General. If you guys, um, the haul will be linked below, but yeah, so I really like this for my pellets and, you know. Next container. So if you guys didn't know, I am a starter um, with a guinea pig. I, I've only had him for a month. So I don't have as much stuff as, like, normal guinea pig owners do. Literally, that's all the rest of my stuff. And I have some stuff over there, too. And there's some stuff scattered around. So... In this top one, I just keep all my everyday usages. I don't really use this every day. I just keep it up here because this is what bin it's in, I guess. But this is what I use every day, my scooper. And then I also use this every day, which is like I put his vegetables on it. This is the activity we got done with like maybe four to five minutes ago. Just put like a lettuce, two pieces of lettuce on it, and I clip it to the cage, and he likes to enjoy it. Um, this I kind of use you know um this i use so many times a day um i started it today um i use i use it all the time so all it is is i just keep my what i do with him in my activities as you could see i haven't held him yet because he doesn't really want to be held right now so that's what's, and then i use this every day so what I like about this is like say I needed to use the middle one. All I have to do is unclip it, 
unclip, lift this one up. No, sorry, I messed up. All right, say I wanted to use the middle one. Unclip the middle sections, and then boom, you know, I can use it. Now say I wanted, like, not to be clipped, I just unclip these ones, simple as that. So I really like this, it just keeps the streets and stuff, and I love this. I love this sectioned airy thing, and I have this at the Dollar General. I've also seen these containers at Walmart too, but I thought, I might as well just buy them at the Dollar General because it's probably cheaper. Next is my hay box. So I got this out of the Dollar General and I highly recommend not buying it. I said not buying it for your hay. So the reason being is I'll show you why. So as you could probably tell, look, I can lift it up. I mean, it's not airtight like it should be, but I still keep my hay in here. So, but I do have a secret. So, every day, every other day, I refill my hay um, thing. Hay thing. Well, hay, what's it called? Rack. So, I just have my every other day filling of my hay. So, I have a couple days worth. So, I have a bag right here, and I made sure that I had some of these in there because Carmel loves them. So, this lasts like two days. This one, I don't know how long this one will last because this one's like a smaller batch, but I mean it should last. And then this one, I have that, I don't know, how. maybe this, I don't know. But this smaller one's just for like, just in case if I need to refill. And then this is all, I'm probably not going to give him all these shavings. Maybe I'll give them for him for like a treat or something or throw them in with the pellets somehow. But, you know, just in case I have to refill them today, even though I filled them yesterday, we have all these. But I'm going to probably pick out these shavings and put them somewhere so I don't get him hooked in his hay, you know. But, yeah. So, yeah, guys, that was my packaged video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Please... Please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. Bye.